Welcome back to another daily WordPress answer, guys. Please make sure to post your questions about WordPress websites and blogging in the comments below. And one lucky user who's featured in our video per month will receive this free cardboard box delivered from Minneapolis via UPS to you. And there's a Dear Blogger coffee mug inside there. So let's get to the question here. Today we have Kamal, where are you? Kamel, excuse me. Sorry about that. Kamel Birkani asking, with a shared plan, can you add a new user to your Bluehost cPanel or to the WordPress site? Awesome question. These are things I don't even think of. The basics are important. Someone might want to know this, clearly, to get hosting and set up WordPress because you might want to add your friends or your developer. And the answer to Kamel's question is yes and yes. But they're really done in the same way. So let me explain. You don't usually add a new user to your Bluehost cPanel. So your Bluehost cPanel is actually located at my.bluehost.com. It's also called your portal. It's where you manage your payment and your user, your profile, your security, all the backend stuff that's Bluehost specific. So from this screen, you can click my sites and then manage site. And then you have users, which is you or me. But this is created inside WordPress. And if you click on your initials to view your profile and click profile, You'll start to see that Bluehost really takes your security very seriously. You can add an account here for single sign-on, but this actually won't let you add another person. It'll just let you add single sign-on features through Google for yourself. So because Bluehost takes security so seriously, they'd rather you not have a lot of people inside your Bluehost. If you do have a developer that you want to give your Bluehost login to, I would say I recommend doing that just in person. Don't email it, don't text your password and your username. Just give them access at a you know a secure place where it's just you two, and then you guys can both figure things out together. Now, if you want to add a user to WordPress, that's actually highly doable because people always add contributors, editors, administrators. A company will add me, for example, just to like fix up their homepage and their hero image and button. To do that, just go to my sites once again, and we can log into WordPress through this Bluehost portal. So click on manage site again, and then click log into WordPress. And that'll take you into whatever WordPress site you created. Okay, so from the screen, all you need to do is hover on users and click add new. Go ahead and pop in the email of the person you're adding, and of course create a username, which you can't change, so make that professional. Then you can create a password for them that you'll both remember or send them a really strong password. Also super importantly, you can change their role. So a contributor would be like a guest blog contributor, which I do a lot of. Author has a little more privileges, editor, editor even more, and administrator is the highest level. That'd be like your web designer that's gonna build the site for you. Even though we have all the tools here, and I pretty much always recommend DIYing it. Once you click add new user, it'll email them a notification that you've created their profile. Just make sure to have them check the spam folder because sometimes it gets sent there and you're all set guys. So that is how to add a new user to wordpress.org and in doing so, add it to Bluehost as well. Should work across other hosts, but obviously Bluehost is an amazing choice that I think will work great for you. Thanks for watching, hope that gives you a little more confidence as you get hosting and set up WordPress. Please make sure to comment because one featured commenter who we answer their question right here in a video will get a coffee mug every month. It's pretty cool. I don't know the economic value of it. It's more like a sentimental value. And you know, who doesn't need more coffee mugs cluttering up their cupboard? So I'll talk to you soon. Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video.